Hello everyone, Nick54222 here. Welcome to another unboxing video from Nick54222. And you're probably wondering why am I doing an unboxing video when I said the next video would be my anime collection video as of some point in early January 2019. Well, there's been a change of plan. Basically, I was planning to do my anime collection video on the 7th, which was a Monday, but I decided not to because as much as I wanted to have my friend in those videos commentary as well, I think I'm good doing it myself. I don't think I'm ready to have him in my videos yet in terms of anime unboxing and stuff, but yeah. We'll do it another time. But anyways, on that day, the last of the five anime they ordered for the first Sentai Flourish wave actually came in because when I was ordering stuff for the second wave of stuff I'm going to be getting over the next few days, they actually were not in back order. Yeah, some of the things have been restocked, and it just so happened that the last thing I ordered from the first wave was a back order, and it came on Monday. So, that means I have to do my anime collection video on the day I record this, which is Wednesday the 9th. And let's get into the video for today, which is going to be an unboxing video of the quote-unquote Hentai Prince and Stony Cat on Blu-ray. Take note of the quotes. It says Hentai. Well, you may be thinking, is it one of those things? Well, if it's one of those things that we know is hentai, why don't I see a Critical Mass video label? Because that's what indicates it was a hentai. But I don't see it. And that's something you gotta know. Basically, hentai is a Japanese word. I believe it means pervert. So it's the pervert prince and the stony cat. And... Yeah, so, anyways, this anime is about a magical stone cat that allows you to switch your traits among people, and pretty much, complications happen after our main character decides to just give it away. And also the main heroine decides to be like, I want to be emotional, or, wait. Yeah, always she wants to be more mature. Yeah. So, anyways. Notice that it says 12 episodes. Here's the thing. This Blu-ray only has one Blu-ray disc. And... From what I heard from Otaku Sensei, or Otaku Spirit, that's what it's called. If, it, if an anime is on Blu-ray for one disc, that's going to be a problem because it's going to have some quality problems. And I'm not just talking about anime, it's talking about any series. Yeah, even Blu-rays have limits. Anyways, we've got Hanako BBS, or that uh, might be some previous and stuff, or other special features. And also the usual clean opening animation, clean closing animation. And there's gotta be some trailers in here. There's gotta be. So let's open this single Blu-ray disc up, in one case, and there we go. It's, it was released back in, I believe, let's see, when it was released, 2014, which means, yeah, it's just going to be one of these older cases I'm used to, not the newer ones. Alright. And here we go. One disc, and that's it. Everything is on this single disc, which means there's going to be probably some quality problems once I get around to seeing it. But yeah. Pretty much that's it. And that's going to be it for all the unboxing videos I'm going to be doing before my next anime collection update. Originally, it's going to be after I got One Punch Man, Full on Panic Saiyan Raid, and Siren of the Shana 3. But that being said, I did order all of them before the end of 2018. So technically, I think that should be all the anime I have in terms of what I have. Well, Everything that I have in terms of what I got before 2019. So, pretty much all the anime that I ordered in 2018 is in my house now. And that's because when I made the second wave of Sunday Force orders, 
they were actually made on the last day of the sale, which was the 5th, and that was in 2019, so. Alright, so, might as well just get into my collection video before the same wave of Sunday Fillers stuff comes in, and it's going to be some Blu-rays and a lot of DVDs of stuff. And it's going to be a lot of fun when we get to it. But yeah, thanks you guys for watching. I'll see you guys tomorrow for the collection video. Again, sorry for the abrupt unboxing video, but this came in and it was part of the order that I made a few weeks ago. And considering that was the last thing I ordered in 2018 that I still needed, probably a good idea. So yeah, next unbox video is going to be something that I ordered in 2019. Alright, later.